The new pledge by China is sure to boost developments in African countries. According to the Chinese president, the $60 billion package will include $20 billion in credit lines, $15 billion in special funds and $5 billion to finance imports from Africa. President Xi asked that Beijing plans to exempt some African countries from interest-free loans, which are due for repayments by the end of this year. Critics have been warning that African countries have been going into unsustainable levels of debt with China, which has loaned billions of dollars to finance major infrastructure development. Fifty-three African delegations, led by presidents and heads of state, are attending the two-day meeting, including the chairman of the African Union, Rwanda's President Paul Kagame, and the United Nations Secretary General Antonio Guterres, and 27 international and African observer missions. Under the theme for this year, China and Africa towards an even stronger community with a shared future through win-win cooperation, the 2018 summit hopes to build on the outcomes of the last high-level meeting held in Johannesburg in 2015. Industry, infrastructure and agriculture all rank highly on the agenda, as well as China's Belt and Road Initiative. The summit concludes on Tuesday with the signing of a declaration and an action plan both expected to guide China-Africa relations for the next three years.